Now we are going to show you one typical figure of Viennese waltz, the hover reverse turn. Hover reverse turn is a five step figure. Now Luke and Tiasha, after taking position, will show you the five step. So we have one, two, three, four, five. One of the most important aspects introduced in the choreography of Viennese waltz is the offbeat timing. Offbeat timing is used when dancing to music with three-quarter time signature. When dancing a figure in which number of beats does not match the number of steps, more beats may be used on some of the steps. Over reverse turn is danced using six beats of music. On step four, two beats will be used. The timing will be and one, two, three, one, two, three. Now we are going to show you a typical basic choreography for Viennese waltz. This choreography includes the following syllabus figure. We have the step four to six of a natural spin turn, a series of reverse turns, ended in a left twist, then two continuous spins, a series of natural turns, continuous spins into the steps five and six of hesitation change. And now we are going to see the choreography with the timing. So the timing will be as follows. And one, two, three, two, two, three, three, two, three, four, two, three, five, two, three, six, two, three, seven, two, three, eight, two, three, one, two, three, two, two, three, three, two, three, four, two, three, five, two, three, six, two, three, seven, two, three, eight, two, three. And now we are going to see the choreography with the music. And. Yeah. 